New at five, neighbors near Chaparral High School say that the new lights put up on the baseball and softball fields are too bright and are calling on the district to do something about it. Team 12's Colleen Sikora is live for us at Chaparral High School this evening as neighbors and their attorney voice their frustrations over the lights on Friday nights. Now, the lights here are new this year. Uh, the district says an anonymous donor fronted the money for these lights, but when they first turned on back in March, neighbors say that's when the problems began. During the day, we can't put the kids to bed because it lights up the whole backyard. It's not obvious why neighbors next to Chaparral High School are frustrated. We, we love living next door to a baseball field. It's always a wonderful sound during the day, but now we have games until late in the evening. But when the sun goes down on game nights, the new lights for the baseball and softball fields turn on. At night, the, my entire backyard is, you know, completely lit up. RJ Crosby's yard backs up to the fields. He moved in back in October. And now I've got five large, you know, poles with lights sticking up. So there's no question that's going to impact my property value. Scottsdale Unified School District says an anonymous donor fronted half a million bucks to put up the lights on the fields. We do not know who the individual is who is making this incredible donation. Saying notices were sent out to everyone living within a half mile radius of the school to invite them to a meeting about the lights. Our home was one of the very few homes that received the postcard. It was a uh, what I would refer to as, as just a sales pitch to tell us about what the lights would do. I think their concerns were put to rest just by speaking with Qualite and also seeing some of these pictures. The district says notices and agendas were posted in accordance with Arizona's open meeting law. The motion carries 5-0. No one showed up for public comment when the district voted on the lights. We didn't know about it. No one knew about it. Now neighbors want to see the lights taken down. They don't need a, a lit baseball field. Now the district and high school sent 12 News a statement that they want to be good neighbors and that the lights were put up to provide a safer place for their student athletes to play their games. A spokesperson also told us that the lights should be turned off by 9 p.m. on game days. We're live in Scottsdale. Colleen Sikora, 12 News. All right, Colleen. Thanks.